How to manage your budget. Budgeting. Perhaps you believe it's too time consuming. You may believe it's nearly impossible to get it accurate. Or maybe even you're afraid of knowing the truth of your financial situation. Yeah? But information is power. The power of opportunity to change things before it's too late. Let's explore some tips that will hopefully help you to begin using a budget, or at the very least, begin tracking your expenses to understand your financial picture. Tip number one Track your money carefully. Maybe this doesn't sound like a tip to you. It may even sound like a deterrent because you associate this with a great time investment. But it may be easier than you think with a great tool called iCash, available for both Mac and PC. The best way to track where you're spending your money is by importing bank statements and credit card statements. iCash has the ability to import your financial statements using either the popular QIF or OFX format. Chances are high that your bank or credit card company already offers these for free download. You just need to take advantage of them. To import, simply download the correct file from your financial institution's website. Choose Import, then OFX since we're about to import an OFX data file, and then hit the Import button. Then choose the file. You'll be asked to which account the imported file should be imported, and you're done. 50% of tracking your money was that simple. On the Transactions panel, you'll be able to see all the imported transactions. iCash builds its reports and graphs from the way you sort your money, so the next step is to sort your transactions by labeling them with the proper origin accounts, or target accounts. When you're all done, iCash can properly build meaningful reports and graphs, like this one. Accurately tracking your money is the foundation of proper budgeting. And as it's the foundation, remember, give yourself time to track and understand your financial picture over several months. Tip number two, set realistic goals. After tracking your spending for at least two months, you will be in a position to set realistic spending goals. Remember, setting unrealistic goals without a clear picture of your financial situation will not be effective. iCash can help you set realistic goals on the Budgets panel. You have it calculate realistic goals for you based on a range of expenses that you've already tracked. Let's track the average of all accounts for the current year and hit the Calculate button. Then the amount column averages are calculated, which serve as a great starting place to begin setting budgeting goals. Then it's easy to compare your current month's spending by clicking Compare with the current month. The color-coded variation column will tell you if you're below budget in blue or over budget in red. Imagine trying to set realistic goals without having tracked your money over a few months. It would be very easy to underestimate your actual spending habits. Tip number three, anticipate expenses. Numerous expenses are regularly occurring, sometimes weekly, sometimes monthly or bi-monthly. Choosing to account for these expenses before the bill arrives is a great way to help budget. iCash's scheduler feature can help you do this easily. To anticipate a monthly phone bill, choose the origin account, checking account. Then choose the target account, telephone. Then choose the expected bill amount. The last step is to choose how often the scheduler should add the pending expense. Click OK to finish. And from the Transactions panel, you can easily see the pending expense for future months in the color gray, so you never forget the expense. Tip number four. Allow for some flexibility with your budget. Don't be afraid to readjust your budget if you find that it isn't working toward both your long-term financial goals and lifestyle. On the Budgets panel, adjustments can be made in multiple ways. You may choose to make fine percentage adjustments across all your expenses. Here, we'll increase our budget by 5% across the calculated averages. Or, we can manually adjust the budgeted amount by clicking right in the field and typing the desired value. See how the variation is immediately updated? Remember, it's okay to budget for reasonable entertainment expenses, too. A budget isn't a binding contract that must be adhered to at all costs. It's a tool to help you achieve your financial goals. Here's a quick review. Tip 1. Track your money carefully. Tip 2. Set realistic goals. Tip 3. Anticipate expenses. 
Tip 4. Allow for some flexibility with your budget. We hope this screencast was helpful to you and that you'll take the helm of your finances with iCash. For more information, visit maxprog.com.